Hello guys, in this tutorial we'll be learning how to make a bootable Windows XP CD. Uh, so for this you'll need to download a Windows XP ISO file. Uh, to download a torrent you'll need a torrent client which is uh, I recommend using uTorrent. You can use uTorrent beta from the download link which I've provided in the video. Uh, I'm not going to download it because I've already done it. And then uh, you'll need to download this torrent over here which is Windows XP Service Pack 3 November 2014. Uh, tech tools after you download uh, this torrent uh, you will need to download a boot image uh, I have provided the link of this also in the description uh, this is required to make your CD bootable uh, you just download it and just save the file and then open it extract it to extract it to D and ok yes ok uh, after this, uh, you'll need to uh, download Demon Tools. Uh, and just click, uh, I've provided the link and just click on the download button. It'll get downloaded. I've already done it. I'm not going to do it again. Uh, after this, uh, you'll need to download Nero 6. Uh, not Nero 6. You can download any of the Nero versions. Uh, but you should have Nero Burning ROM in it. You can download Nero Burning ROM separately or uh, with the pack just like this Nero 6 Ultra Edition. You'll have Nero Burning ROM in that. And then uh, the next step is you'll have to uh, go to the file there uh, in the one which you have downloaded it and then just open with and demon tools light uh, your, uh, your image will get mounted let us wait for it to happen yeah it's done uh, now you go ahead oh, I've done two of them just okay uh, so now uh, you will need to open this yeah and then copy all these files into a folder let's do it into the folder windows xp service pack 3 yeah, and paste it there Okay, I'll pause. The, I'll go ahead and pause the video now, and I'll resume when the copying is done. Okay, it's done copying now. Uh, now let's go ahead and open our uh, Nero Burning ROM. Yeah. Okay. Uh, here you will have to select the CD boot op CD ROM boot option. yeah and here uh, you just select the image file option browse and browse the uh, Im IMA image file which you have downloaded and click on open and then click on this enable expert settings and choose this kind of emulation to no emulation and number of loaded sectors to 4 ok and then click on the ISO tab make sure all of these is checked and uh, all of these options are set right and then you'll go to label and you'll have to label win your windows cd as this otherwise it won't work properly uh, you'll have to label it as w x c c p underscore e n it's actually w x p sorry yeah and then after that make sure this option also use iso 9600 test for uh, juliet is check and go to burn right and then after that you will have to select your burning speed to the lowest possible and then uh, choose the number of copies and then click on new yeah now what you'll have to do is just locate all uh, the files which you have transferred from your uh, uh, image file okay let's locate it and then select it and drag it to your disk okay it's done now just click on burn and uh, your bootable CD is ready. Thank you. Please like and subscribe the video.